just you just gonna follow that when you see him, okay? You know, Tank, he's a singer songwriter. He's written some of the most amazing songs. Now he's in a trio. I mean, he is just just just, just give the camera to him. Just Tank, everybody. Woo! All right. <laughs> Fantastic, thank you. Put the spotlight on his muscles. <laughs> thank you, Tank, for that. Just got finished doing a set of 3,500 <laughs> bicep curls, so I'm in the building. Well, actually, I think it's perfect to go into it. You're, you have, like, an initiative now, right? Yes, got a fitness campaign um, called Stronger You. Yes. Um, and, you know, it, it, it's... It's basically like right now just getting people started, okay. getting people's bodies moving, yeah. getting them walking, getting them dancing, um, just preparing them to exercise and getting them in a better space, space spiritually, mentally, and physically, I not just that. one part. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody don't want to look like me. Everybody don't want to eat what I eat. Everybody doesn't want to do the same things that I do, but they Tank, do want to be better let me stop you there. We yeah. definitely want to look like you, okay? <laughs> we want to look just like you, okay? We want to eat exactly, we want to do everything you do. No, I'm kidding. So that's awesome. Keep telling but yeah, me. But, it, but for the people who just want to be better versions of themselves, yeah. you know what I mean? We're approaching it from that standpoint, you know what I mean? It, we're, we're trying to meet everybody in their own space personally and, and, and try to personalize these things. So the Stronger You is kicking off. We got a whole thing we're doing today with like 50 ladies where yes. they're going to work out with me. We're going to do the whole thing. I'm going to go to Vegas with me. We're going to yeah. Stronger You is in full effect. No, I'm right. actually excited myself. Um, so how did this come about? Because it's kind of like what Michelle Obama, kind of like the MOVE campaign in mm -hmm. a way. So you're well, like going to different cities. Is that what you're yes. doing? we're going okay. to different cities while we're on the promo tour for the album. And, yes. and it really came about um, because, you know, Everybody knows me for being in shape. Yeah. Everybody's always in me. Tank oh. always in shape. You know what I'm saying? And I'm like, well, how do we, um, how do we give away this knowledge? How yes. do we give away this good information um, so that people can benefit from it? Not just look at me, but you know, figure out how to right. do some of the things that I'm doing. And so we box it up and put it in the brand and said, yeah. let's march it out. And so now we got, we had a 30 day uh, fitness campaign okay. online, where everybody online follow me on Instagram, Twitter. They rock with me for the 30 days leading up to the album. I saw that. Right. Yeah, yeah. So I, the diet, Rob Hill Senior giving woo, mental okay. advice. Uh, we had a pastor giving spiritual yes. advice. Like we got it. We got it all laid down. Okay. Right. That's and so now we got the expert expert trainer series coming up. Oh, where right. advanced. For, advanced. Okay. For the for advanced. The, for the go hard. You know what I'm saying. And then we yeah. have the pregnancy series after yes. that. Yes. Okay. You know what I mean. So, so you you touching all, covering all we're, bases. We're covering all bases, and you know it's all geared around you know stronger, stronger you, stronger. The album was August 12th. Stronger me, stronger you, stronger. Stronger everybody. us yeah. together. Stronger everybody. us. I love it. I love it. Okay. So now I, I you you have your own album, but you're also in a group at the same time, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So how does that work where you where you're able to release your own is everybody kind of doing their own thing and then yeah. when you guys come together cuz let me tell you let me let me tell you something I wore that album out. Do you hear me? Oh, like the whole thing on my phone, my iPad, the car, I wore it out. I mean, just everything. Like when it, people are going to die when they see this interview because like all of my friends are like sangers, okay? And they love, love, love you. You're like the God, okay? So how are you guys able to do all of your own separate projects, kill it? Tyrese is doing movies. You're over here just releasing albums, campaigns, and then you guys come back together. How does, how does that kind of work it's, out? It's really just, it's tricky. Okay. I mean, it, it really just boils down to schedule. Okay. You know what I mean? And so, you know, we'll try to just carve out time. Yeah. Like say, you know what, we'll think far enough ahead and say, these months are for this. Okay. And then that's it. You yeah. know what I mean? And so it's tough because with TGT, it's so much that we can do that we haven't been able to do. Yeah. Because of our own individual schedules and deadlines that we're trying to meet individually. Yeah. But, um, you know, with the next album, I think we'll do better with that, with, with taking TGT to everybody that wants to see it. Okay. We, we didn't get to do that this time. Yeah, I mean, because I remember the one, we you talking about scheduling, the one, um, Arsenio Hall. Yeah. So, like, how did, is it, was that yeah. like a, was that something where everybody it had their own things? No, it was a fiasco where, <laughs> where one, one camp confirmed and confirmed <laughs> for everybody. Okay. And, and, the other one didn't. and everybody was like, what? Yeah. The day before, like, what do you mean we have our senior hall tomorrow? Oh. I won't even be in town, you yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, so yeah. Um, we, won't, we don't have those conflicts anymore, okay. but that's how that type of thing happens. So does everybody have their own manager? Do you have, like, everybody has their own manager. And then TGT everybody. has a manager? No. So TGT doesn't have their own manager? TGT doesn't have their own manager. <laughs> really? No. So you guys manage yourselves? Well, our manage individual managers <laughs> manage, manage together. together. That's awesome. You know what I'm saying? That's kind of cool. They have a two-hour conference call. I'm sure that is a lot. I mean, to have to deal with the three of you all together? Yes, yeah, too much. That's crazy. It's too much. It's a lot going on. But yeah. 
you know, for the sake of what we're trying to do um, and for the effect that it has had thus far, I mean, it's been worth it. Wore the it's album completely it. out. Yeah, thank okay. You so, much. so now we're we're talking about Tank though right now. So mm -hmm. tell us a little bit about what we can expect from this album. Stronger. What is what does stronger mean? You know. Sh stronger is um, August twelfth. Yes. Pre order right now. If you want to make <laughs> That's me look what it good. Means. If you want to make me look good. <laughs> <laughs> and um, and of it's, course we do. it's it's me it's me leaning to my strengths. Okay. You know what I mean? It's me, of course, spiritually and mentally be, becoming a stronger person as a result of you know all these albums I've had to live through, all the events through these albums I've had to live mm -hmm. through. Anybody that knows me knows that my writing is very personal. Yes, it is. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I've been through a bit, but you know I finally come to a space where you know I've 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 accepted. 100% um, what I do well. Okay. You know what I mean? And and me trying to reintroduce that to people who love it the way that I love it and, and grew up on it the way that I grew up on it. When you hear this album, you'll hear so many um, nostalgic moments from Michael Jackson to Marvin Gaye to Earth, Wind & Fire to Rick James to Marvin Gaye. You know what I'm saying? You'll, you'll, you'll be listening like, that sound like, or that feels like. Yeah. And it does. It okay. should. Because I just want to reintroduce that the real that tech. quality, yeah. the real, the, the, that, the things that made me and made me, uh, made me who I am and yeah. good at what I do. And at the same time, for the new R and B listeners and singers, you know what I mean. I, I still do what I do on Absolutely. top of that bed of of nostalgicity. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. In order to pull it all together, so it's it's just it's it's great music. Okay. You know what I mean? That we're missing, and then part two of what we're missing is we're missing happy, fun R and B music. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, like when is the last time you asked somebody to go out dancing, or you know what I'm saying, Ooh, or just yeah, to go out dancing, you know, I to go roller skating. You know what I'm saying? Like and, a, and a good R&B song was yeah. on. You know what I'm saying? Besides, not, ha well, happy, but that's kind of crossover. Well, I'm happy it's an R&B song. Okay. I mean, we can call it whatever we want. Okay. It's an R&B record good. because that's that's where we came from. Yes. You know what I mean? We came from the Temptations and all the people where the, where the temple had to collapse on and all that. Like all that was that was ours. Yeah. And so we got to get back to. Um, R&B being fun, love being great, and about being in relationships and seeing the sunshine as a result of it. You seem like such a 